I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> so uh, if you're watching this video, there's, I guess, welcome back. If you somehow used to be subscribed to this channel or maybe welcome if this is the first time that you're on this channel. Um, who am I? What do I do? Frankly, I do not know anymore. I, uh, I started recording a video series about a year ago around this time, I'd say. And in that series of recordings, I was talking about the future, talking about the uncertainty of the future and the uncertainty of being a content creator, more specifically myself in my content creator journey. I got to this point this year where I realized I didn't know what I was doing because I didn't really have a direction but I'm starting to wonder if it's okay to not have a direction. Right now, it is March 1st, and I now have 30 days remaining in my current employment. And at that point, I will be out into the ether with everybody else to kind of just figure it out, I, I would say. I think that's what everybody has to do at some point. This isn't my first rodeo with this, but kind of just trying to figure it out. And along the way, um, you know, starting five years ago when I restarted doing content creation, I picked up some hobbies that had a direction as to where I was going. I, I thought I'd be some sort of like tutorial based YouTuber. Then I got into cosplay. I thought I'd be a cosplay YouTuber. I got into collecting, thought I'd be a toy hunting toy collector YouTuber. And I found myself going down this wormhole of looking at all these other channels and watching people succeed at YouTube and saying, I really wish I could have a direction. So what's funny is in, in attempts to beat the algorithm and in an attempt to do this previously, this is my first of three YouTube channels. I have this one. I created the Hey Archer channel. I created Nerd Affiliated. Then they switched and Hey Archer became Nerd Affiliated and Nerd Affiliated became Hey Archer. And in my attempt to beat the algorithm, I went astray again. I went astray again. Then I thought maybe I can beat the algorithm on Instagram. I had one Instagram turned into five Instagrams. Maybe even six technically, but Anthony runs that one. So, direction, a theme. What is the theme? What is the lane? But then that begs the question. I wonder if that stifles you as a creator to say, I need to have a direction. I need to have a focus. I need to have a specific thing I talk about. And really, that's all thanks to the algorithm. It's the algorithm of Instagram, the algorithm of YouTube, the algorithm of TikTok. If you stay in a lane, you can eventually grow in that lane. But at what point are you stifling yourself as a creator by only staying in a lane when you have so many hobbies, so many interests, so many things that you want to do? I feel like it'd be easier just to be a cat. Just lay around. You're, you have one lane. The lane is... Eat, sleep, sh repeat. It's pretty basic. It's pretty easy. You look out the window sometimes. Maybe you look for a toy and play with it. But you kind of just exist and you hang out. Or you supervise as your owner is making a video talking to nobody in a room. Hmm. But what should the direction be of the revitalization of this channel? What should the direction be? Who, who am I? What is this channel? I think documenting, photographing, all of it is going to be the, the direction. That is, that maybe that is the that is my algorithm. My algorithm isn't just talking about the gear. 
the algorithm isn't just talking about event photography. The, the, the journey isn't just talking about a specific thing, but merely talking about all of it. And maybe we all learn something along the way. Maybe. So no fancy intros, no fancy outros, which I do very much love if you follow me along the way. But um, this will merely be an entry in my journal, an entry in the diary. I would say this is an entry in... And just so we could say we had a lesson today, this video is being recorded at 24 frames per second or 23 point whatever the decimal is, if you're that nerdy about it. And it will be uploaded to 4K in case YouTube wants to treat it a little bit differently because it's uploaded in 4K. End chapter.